chances to win the game. I think we let ourselves down with a few errors that obviously they're going to capitalise on. They're top of League Two, they're absolutely flying. So, you know, I think we did hold ourselves, you know, in a really high regard today. And like I said, I think we could have won the game, but, you know, it's going to be a tough place to go, you know, go, go there on a Tuesday night. But I think we've got the fight and, and desire and belief that we can go there and, and win it and then, you know, face West Brom in the next round. Things obviously got off to a very good start, and you, well, you, I guess you got an assist for that, didn't you? I mean, it was a deflected effort, but we'll give it to Stokesy, which yeah, means yeah. you got an assist. Brilliant run down the left. That was something we saw a lot of today. Mm. Is, is that something you're starting to do? Obviously, it's, 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 you've played wing back before, but moving over to the other side is a, di a little different. So you're yeah. starting to get a, a grip of that. Yeah, it's, it's completely different from the right to the left, um, and it takes a while for me to to adjust. To be fair, and and I'm embracing the challenge. Um, you know, going forward, I want to be able to take take people on more. I don't always want to just, you know, come back or, or try to take them on and always get beat. It's something that's in my head and, you know, I feel like I'm slowly getting better at it. Um, and going the other way as well, you know, there was a, a game against Rochdale where the, in the first half, the uh, the wing had my pants down, I can't lie, in the first half and, and, it, and it proper got into my head. So just trying to work m my best on, you know, 1v1 defending and, and 1v1 going forwards and I think I'm slowly getting better at it and, uh, you know, adjusting to the position well. Exactly, because it's a position that is, you know, you've got to be good in attack and you've definitely got to be good in defence as well. So, And that was definitely something that was needed today, you know, two all, it's, it's both teams had their chances. So what was your thoughts of the game out there? Yeah, it was, you know, it was, it was a great game. Um, you know, that, like I said, they're, they're, they're flying, we're, you know, we are flying as well. So it was always going to be a good spectacle. Um, and, you know, I think we held ourselves, you know, like I said, in really high regard. Um, you know, they had some tricky players, you know, some proper, you know, experienced players. And I think... I think we did really well, and, and I think I did, we did let ourselves down, you know, to come out straight away second half and concede. Um, and but you know, we, we've got to stay strong and, and go again on Tuesday. It does seem like there's the confidence within the group that we can go out there and just beat anybody on the day. Was, is that something that has been the case? Yeah, you know what, like fr from the start of the season, obviously I've been here for a while now. I did not expect this, you know, to be the case. We can genuinely take any team to the sword. You know, they're top of League Two, and if I'm being honest we probably could have won today it could have gone the other way as well but um, you know we, we dug in and, and defended really well and our professionalism was top today so apart from obviously the, you know the few mistakes that we made um, and I genuinely go into every game believing we can win it doesn't matter who the, who the opponent is if you know if we did get through today and we had West Brom I think we'd still believe we have a chance. It's obviously a team effort we know that but when you've got Laurent scoring a hat-trick yeah. in the fourth qualifying round you've got Jack scoring a hat-trick in the last round you've got Josh Stokes scoring twice today yeah. it's just it's just, it must be fill you with confidence knowing that you've got teammates that can just turn it on like that yeah and like I said I've, I've been here for a while now and we haven't had that so for me personally it's very refreshing to have front players that you know you know if you play balls in behind or you know there's there's crosses coming in that there's a very high chance that they're going to score um, so it's very reassuring for the, for, for the back line which obviously I'm kind of part of and midfield that we've got front players that are just on fire and you know we've got people like Kean as well chipping in with goals we've got goals from you know everywhere on the pitch so you know it's really promising